Hi, I'm Rachel, and today we're going to be going over teaching partial sums to second graders. So, partial sums equations, we line up like any other equation. Um, let's do plus 34. Anytime we're doing addition, we line it up like this, right? But with partial sums, we do something different. We separate with lines the ones place, right? The tens place. And maybe you're gonna have a hundreds place if you have you know, a three digit number, but here we're just dealing with the tens and the ones, very simple. So, we have to add, first we look at the tens place, and here we have a four, and then we're actually gonna put a zero in the ones to start with. Then we keep going down, and we put a zero here, and then this is 10, right? Six plus four. So we actually are gonna change this into a one and put a zero there because this is 10, right? So there's a one in the tens and a zero in the ones. And then we just add them just like we normally would. Zero plus zero is zero and four plus one is five. So the answer is 50, but we use partial sums because we added it with these columns. I'm Rachel, and thank you for learning with us today.